What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Sam from Team Zarex right here and today guys I'm coming at you with 20 packs of the brand new Chaos Impact sneak peek opening for you guys today So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video earlier on this morning My brother and I went to two different locals to try to get you guys 20 packs of the Chaos Impact opening So let's see how many secret rares we can get out of these packs I'm very excited for this set new gladiator beast support as you guys can see right now We get gladiator beast Vesparcius We can also get it as a promo ultra rare out of this Chaos Impact sneak peek which is actually very awesome because I believe that this card comes in has a rare in the set I'm just trying my best to get all the cards for the gladiator beast deck as soon as possible Like what I'm looking for is obviously the Marin says blue tang. I'm looking for striker dragon All right guys, I won't waste any more of your time without further ado Let's just start it with these 20 packs of the brand new chaos impact sneak peek opening. Let's do it All right guys sneak peek number one. Let's see on what cards. Oh We can't out of this thing right here. All right, let's go uh, Mimi Kuro, Mimi Kuro, Brian, Brian Nagir, Brian Nagir, nice, what is this, Sea Serpent card, never seen this card ever uh, in my life, Marin says Cascade, cool, Pentasos, the Dream Mirror Foe, I heard that Dream Mirror obviously got brand new support uh, out of this Chaos Impact, and the deck actually just got better, I know that they're missing a couple more cards, but right now, the deck actually has lots of potential moving on onto the upcoming format. Jelly Cannon, Seraphim, uh, Papillion. This kind of reminds me of uh, the card, uh, the Butterfly from Godzilla for some reason, but there you go. Marin says Crown Tail, Marin says Snow, and last but not least, we got no, no, what's it called? No Ultra Rare or Secret Rare out of that pack, but that's okay. All right, uh, Infinity Track, Bruto Dozer. Come on, camera focus. Uh, Action Magic, Double Banking. Cool. Prime Mineral, uh, Man Strong. So this card right here, you can actually set it, uh, which is actually really amazing. So you can set this card from your hand to your spawn trap card zone as a spell. During the end phase, if this card is in your graveyard because it was destroyed by your opponent card effect this turn, who all set on your field, you special in this card, then you can add one monster from your graveyard to your hand, uh, which is really awesome. But the problem with this card is that Cosmic Cyclone is running around everywhere. So, you know, this card might not get too much value if everyone's running Cosmic Cyclone, right? So nice. Burning Shell, Marin says Crystal Heart. Really cool. Makes your mirror says Link Monster uh, become like a tower, which is really nice. Dream Mirror, rare. Action Magic, full turn. Or Legacy World Key. Nothing for the second pack. Let's see on what Ultra we can get next. Or at least a Secret Rare, man. That'll be good. Like out of one of these piles, a Secret Rare would be nice. Action Magic, Double Banking, Cauldron of the Old Man, nice. This is um, Poison of the Old Man, but this is Cauldron of the Old Man. So when this card is activated, place one counter on it. Gain 500 light points for each counter on this card. Inflict 300 damage to your opponent for each counter on this card. So another burn card, uh, which is actually really amazing. Pretty cool. Bounty, okay, cool. So you're attacking monster, destroys an opponent monster by battle. Target one card in your graveyard, add it to your hand. Nice, it's a really cool card to actually recycle your hand traps directly from your graveyard back to your hand, uh, which is really cool. So. Bounty, Tenji Spirit, uh, Ashuna, nice. Uh, Marin says Battle Ocean, Action, Magic, Full Turn, Luna the Dark Spirit, Astro Goals, and that's pretty much it. All right, guys, next pack. Let's see what we get. All right, is this card a Sky Striker card? Holy crap, this card looks so sick. Tell me this doesn't look like a Sky Striker card. It looks like a Sky Striker card. Crusher Run, oh. Mirrors of Sea Angel, Bye Bye Damage, Gorgon, and Prism of the Evil Eyed. I heard this card was a Prismatic Secret Rare or the Alternative Art Secret Rare, but it looks really awesome. Arrow Mage, Soul Levy, and Desert Locust. All right, guys, last and final pack. Let's see what we get. So Tachyon Spiral Galaxy, cool. Protocol Gardener, Mirrors Sea Angel. Ooh, Starly Cyphert. Right here, this is the first secret that we get. It has similar effect as uh, Brotar. So basically what this card does is that you can send any number of dragon monsters from your hand or face on the field of the graveyard, and you add one dragon monster uh, from your deck to your hand whose level equals to the total original levels of those monsters sent to the graveyard. So basically, if you discard level four uh, dragon, you basically get a search of level four dragon directly from your deck to your hand. So what makes this card so good is that if you bring it off LP, you can actually trigger off this card's effect to discard a level four dragon like any rocket monster to add like a color serpent or a wyvern buster directly from your deck to your hand. You can also banish this card from your graveyard and target one level eight light or dark dragon monster in your graveyard had it to your hand. You can use each effect of Starly Cyphered once per turn. So what's really good about this card is that you can actually recycle back Chaos Dragon Hylvainir directly from your graveyard to your hand, which is really good. And also at the same time, you can activate both effect in the exact same turn. So Starly Cyphered, absolutely amazing. Don't know how much this card is, uh, but I'm really glad that we at least got one secret rare. After the second sneak, 
let's see what we get. So, action magic double banking. Ooh, Wailing of the Unchained Souls right here. New Unchained Archetype, which is really awesome. Like a super poly archetype. Okay. Overburst Dragon. World Legacy World Key. Mirror says Wonder Heart. Galactic Spiral Dragon. And Dances with Beasts. All right. Let's go off to the next pack. Let's see what we get. All right. So, Cho Choban Armor Dragon. Okay. Uh, Abomino Chamber of the Unchained. Primario Matt Strong. Ooh, Striker Dragon. Thank you. Thank you. So this card is so good. This is the card that Dragon Links is missing. And it requires one level four lower Dragon Monster. This card is Link Summon. You can add one Boot Sector launch from your deck to your hand, which is really good. A Boot Sector launch is amazing for any Dragon Link based stack. You can try one face of monster you can control and one rocket monster in your graveyard. Destroy that monster on the field. If you do, have that other monster from your graveyard to your hand. The secondary effect is actually very awesome as well, but the primary effect is what makes this card really good because it makes any rocket monster a one card extender, which is really amazing because it's searching Boot Sector launch directly from your deck to your hand. Extender combo plays significantly. So, uh, Striker Dragon is really great. Gladiator Beast, Segatari, really cool. That name sounds super sick. And uh, that's pretty much it for this pack right here. So far, so good. Striker Dragon is great. Really great card. All right. Uh, Infinite Track, Brutal Dozer, Primario Mad Strong, Abdominal Chamber of the Unchained, DD Patrol Plane, Dream Mirror Phantasm. Nice. Cool. Unchained Twin uh, Rakia. Oh, cool. World Legacy World Key, and Marin says Battle Ocean. All right, so, so far one Ultra there, which is not bad at all. Okay, let's see if we can get any other. Send one monster from your deck to the graveyard. Before a Renaissance turn, you cannot activate cards or effect of cards with the same name. The sent monster had in the graveyard. You can only activate one peaceful Hiberio per turn. All right, last pack. Let's see what we get. Come on. Ooh, Fantasso is the Dream Mirror friend. Cool, so more Dream Mirror cards. So far, we only got, uh, what is it called? We got how many? Um, we got one Secret Rare. And I believe one ultra rare, no two ultra rares so far. Uh, but yeah, one secret rare is good. Uh, Cauldron of the Old Man, Primario uh, Congrate. Wait, yeah, 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 right here. This card is yeah. I'm just tripping. I thought this card was a was a common for some reason. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, that's different. That's different. Okay, there you go. This Primario Congrate and this Primario Mad Strong. Cause when I saw him, I'm like, wait, wait, I'm like, does this card come as a common? So this is the other one. It's gonna be normal summon reset. Must be special summoned by a card effect. Hit a monster sent to the, uh, from your opponent's hand uh, or deck to the graveyard. Except due to damage, that be special this card from your hand or in face on defense position. Hit this card to the face up target, which will up to two cards on the field and destroy them, which is great. Also, oh, there's synergy with primary old match from because you can potentially just destroy your own cards. You're destroying your own artifacts, uh, which is pretty nice. So primary old congrate is nice. Not bad, not bad. Next pack. Crusher run. Marin says blue tang. Yes, we got blue tang. Cool, cool, cool. She's amazing. One card starters. I actually believe that Marin says has huge potential within the next upcoming format, which is really nice. So Marin says blue tang is really good. It's a foolish barrel for the deck. It's a one card combo. If you guys haven't checked out the deck profile, make sure you guys check it out. It is on my channel featuring blue tang. It also has the XMB, the top three cards effect, which is really nice. So far, so good. I can't complain. The packs have been really good so far. So two secret rares out of, uh, I believe, 20 packs is, is, is really solid. So Gizmek Yada, uh, the Gleaming Vanguard. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let's go out to the next pack. Let's see what we get. All right, Action Magic, Double double Banking, Summon Great Burning Shell, Suppression Collider. Oh, oh, two secret rares! Two secret rares! Guys, two secret rares in the exact same sneak. Two secret rares in the exact same sneak. Yo, guys, we're winning. We're winning. Wow. Unchained Soul of the Anguish right here. The uh, Link 3 uh, Unchained Monster right here. Card looking very nice. Two secret rares in one sneak peek, guys. So far, so good. Very, very nice. Smash that thumbs up button, guys. My luck has been insane. Smash that thumbs up button right now. So, Mirror's Cascade, Watch Train, Cloudy Beast, Comeback, Infinite Track, Brutal Dozer. Dream Mirror, Hip, uh, Hypna Golgia. Nice. Gladiator Beast United. Guys, Gladiator Beast. I need to go back to Locals right now and get as many Gladiator Beast cards as soon as possible. So well, let's go off to the very fourth sneak peek. Let's see what we get out of the fourth sneak. So Evil Tau. Cool. Bye Bye Damage. Gladiator Beast Comeback. Oneros, the Dream Mirror, uh, Urkling. Nice. Bless Winds. Uh, so far, so good. Okay. We need... Ultra would be nice. Bye bye damage. 
Protocol Garden up. Mirror says Crystal Heart. Really good. Right here. Mirror says uh, Mandarin right here. Also very awesome. Next hack. Let's see what we get. Alright. Watch Train. Oh, it looks like it's a Grand Knight. Uh, I was going to call it Grand Knight Loyalist. But it's a uh, Gallant Grand Knight. Cool, so basically this card searches in the Bureau uh, directly from Redactor, which is very awesome. You can detach one material from this card and activate one of these effects. You can add one Rock Monster from your deck to your hand, so you can add Nabu, uh, Fossil Dino, which is really awesome. I forgot any other Rock Monsters, but those are the two ones that stick out the most. So Nabu and also uh, Fossil Dino, very awesome. And the best card, and the best Rock Monster to select is obviously, uh, what's the card's name? Uh, Nabu, so there you go. Dream Mirror, uh, Phantasms. That would be Vespar uh, Vesparcius. This card is a rare, uh, but it comes as a, as an ultra rare. As you guys can see right here, it comes as an ultra rare uh, out of the promos, which is actually very awesome. Cool. All right, guys, last and final pack of Destiny. Let's see if we can get at least one more secret rare on ultra rare. All right. Gladiator Beast, oh, Dami uh, Tianis, right here, this card's obviously in the gate of the deck. Guys, that's pretty much it for my packs, guys. Godly opening, very godly. I pulled three secret rares. Uh, which is really awesome out of four sneaks. I also pulled a decent amount of ultra rares as well. Striker Dragon, Gallant, Grand Knight. A bunch of great cards out of this set, uh, which is really good. My luck still stays undefeated. So three secret rares out of four sneaks is just very good in my personal opinion. If you guys want to support the channel, make sure you guys get your Egyptian God card play mat today. Hit the link in the description box below and use the code TX10 for 10% off your entire order. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is your boy Sam from Team Sam Sam signing out. All right, guys. Peace. Let's go, let's go.